You are watching the Dangerous News Network, and I am Daniel McFarland. And today's topic is going to be about the review of the Detroit Tigers against the Boston Red Sox. Now, as you know, um, the Boston Red Sox, they beat the Detroit Tigers. And let's look at the shortcomings of the Detroit Tigers. The manager... He made some mistakes, two mistakes that cost the Detroit Tigers the World Series, and, yes, it cost Jim Leland his job. He retired, but that's what I'm going to um, expound on on the next podcast for YouTube. (coughs) But, it's pretty. It's very well possible that the Tigers were just not that great. The starting pitching is an asset. The relievers sucked, and the lineup one-dimensional, very one-dimensional. You don't. You have a lineup that can't that can't beat you in more than just one way. You have no team speed, and the ones that does have a little bit of speed, they can't they can't steal a base. They don't have they can't run they can't run on the bases. That's something that has got to change. That's something that's got to change. And um, let's look at left field. Johnny Peralta is not a left fielder. Austin Jackson is okay, but he's not a leadoff hitter. He's not a leadoff hitter. He has shown that beyond a shadow of a doubt. And Torrey Hunter, he disappointed me. I thought he was a leader. But he has shown me that I was wrong. Miguel Cabrera is not a third baseman. Jose Iglesias might not have a stick. Um, Omar Infante, well, he's not he's not very clutch in the playoffs either. But unfortunately, he might be the best we got that's available. I do not trust Kelly Johnson. <clears throat> I don't trust Kelly Johnson. I don't. I don't think he's that good. We need a second baseman that's good. And Omar Infante, he's a two way hitter. Robinson can know is too expensive, probably. Prince Fielder, he's a choke artist. He has shown that time and again. (coughs) And Victor Martinez is our most clutch player. Alex Avila can't hit his way out of a wet paper bag. That's, um, That's your lineup for you. That's your lineup for you. We need to keep Verlander and Scherzer. We need to keep Verlander. We need to keep Scherzer. Sanchez and Fister, they're your top four pitchers next year. We build that bullpen, get some team speed in the lineup, but what I'm proposing may not be the most ideal, and that is what's coming up next on the Dangerous News Network. And this is the Dangerous News Network. I am Daniel McFarland, and I approve this message.